fellow survivors, I'm the Survivalist, and welcome back to Enter the Gungeon. Now, it is both with good, great joy and bad vocabulary, bad speaking, and also a bit of sadness as well that we are coming back to Enter the Gungeon. Because not too long ago, Enter the Gungeon let out its final content update, which is the Farewell to Arms Bash. And I have to say, Dodge Roll, you did amazing work with the game. It's sad to hear that no new up or no new content updates will be done. Maybe balance or bug fixes will continue. But I'm also very excited to see what else the studio will move on to next, and just what other ideas they come up with because they executed Enter the Gungeon so well. It, it is one of the few games I would call a perfect game. It stuck to its theme well. It tunes controls perfectly. It just it was a great time, but we're going to go in because we have some new stuff to try unlocking. So on my previous videos, we did the marine. Now we're going to go in with the hunter or the hunter. I am mixing up risk of there, but we're going to go with the hunter and see if we can get some new stuff unlocked. So like any other great dungeon run, you just oh, actually already got something. The evolver. Uh, I better check the shop in case. Nope, doesn't look like anything else in there. Uh, just in case, we'll talk to these guys in case maybe there's a new mission for them. Looks like you've finished. Bull hail, master returns, hunt goes on. Hunt the gun nut. Okay, so maybe there's nothing else really new aside from that little purchase we had there. I think... Oh, that's right, we can pet the doggo. I forgot they added that in. And a little Twitter account made it possible. It was, can you pet the dog? Or, can you pet the dog? Or something like that. But even that, just a perfect little addition to the game. Just adds so much flair. And, well, not even a lot of flair, but just a little more flavor to it. But we're just going to hop in, start going through the gungeon, and see how we have to unlock, or what we got to do to get some new things. It feels good to be back, but also has been a little while, so I admit I'm probably going to be a little rusty when it comes to some gameplay. I do want to try remembering one of the old rules, or one of the things I found most helpful was don't rely overly on dodge, because that can't get you into trouble as much as you think it'll get you out of it. Far though, I think we're doing pretty good. I meant to pet the puppo. Ah, even then though, that's still a pretty good item to get, I suppose. I don't know, maybe we will try to... I think we will try to get the boss down without opening the gun chest. Because I'm... I don't know if that would have changed. There's supposed to be quite a bit with the update. There's two sort of new characters. I think it's more like one and a half in a way. Uh, we don't really have any money. Would like to get the key, but we're going to probably have to just clear the floor first. But there's a new floor that you somehow get to. There's one and a half new characters. One I think is sort of like a grab bag almost. There's a new mode you can run through. There's just a lot of interesting stuff that they put in. I'm really eager to start going through and see if we can't unlock. There we go. And it's always just a fun game to go through, play with the gun and see what you can get. It's another, like Risk of Rain, where it's just sure you know it, what you're doing, but it's never exactly the same. And you just kind of feel that reward from it, what you play and put into it. Okay, just kind of odd to have the random blue flame in here. I don't know if it means anything. Actually, I think there are quite a few new rooms that have been put in, because this is even the first floor, and this is a little different than what I thought we might see. And with the 
save heart containers now. That was such a nice little change. And come on, Pupper Dupper. Or Junior 2, I think, actually. Let's check that. If we're going to call it. Ooh, Chamber Gun. Cat Bullet King Throne. Ticket. Evolver. Okay, yeah, so he's Junior 2, and it sounds like we have quite a few new things already, and some mysteries to see as well. The the JK-47? I'm curious to see what we can, what all these new guns are. I don't know if there are special unlocks, or if they might just be part of the Gungeon drop tools already. I don't know if we'll go down the secret floor. We'll head up this way. Oh. Oh, do I get that now, or do... Oh, that would make the boss so easy. Ah, you know what? What the hell? It's an S-chest. I don't want to pass up an S-chest. So we are going to go and get an S-gun. Ooh, and it's a strafe gun. Doesn't look like any secret rooms off of there. And before we go wasting too much ammo, we might as well take the boss down. The trigger twins. S-Gun is a really nice one, it just can really tear through bosses pretty easily. A little bit of money, not bad. Oh, the boxing glove. That's good to have. Let's take a look and see. I'm kind of tempted to try... I'm thinking Secret Room could be off of this one, just because of how these kind of extra... That's look like down there. What about down here? Nope, nothing. Maybe not there. Well, that's kind of a little gap there, isn't it? Uh, not there. Nothing there. Not there. And we've used both of our blanks off. Eh, about center base worth it, so we're already good to go down the next floor. I want to try unlocking the new characters, and I think I might be able to get both, depending on how... Well, I say how good I am, but how much I don't screw up. Oh, that's where you're hiding. There we go. Take care of the bullet sharks. There we go. Ooh, good pupper. We gotta pet the puppy. Good junior too. Ah oh, shoot. I should have dodged that. No, I'm not exactly doing the hottest so far, am I? I gotta just. I mean, we got a key for how terribly that went, but. Ooh, another S chest! And blueprints. Ooh! That's a perfect find. Okay. Boss is down there. The other one's going to be a gun chest. But because we have an S already, I think we can skip opening that other chest for now. And take care of him. Oh, there's the other one. Thought that one was another one of you guys. There we go. Okay, 
and that's them taken care of, so let's go down here. Oh god. Too much health. Okay. A few good things. You know what? I think I'm going to drop the boxing glove. It's getting me in too much trouble. There we go. So uh, I could buy a full heart. Oh, Casey, you could be very good. Yeah, we're going to get Casey. Casey is a very nice weapon to have, but it is one of the ones where you can really hurt yourself with it. No, oh, come on. I know I'm rusty, but this is just getting bad. Okay, there we go. Another key. As much as I am being a complete failure, that's the only way I can call how shoddy I am compared to how some of my other runs have gone. We are at least getting some things that may help us later on. Take care of that. Badly, I am messing up with how much damage I am taking. We are just going to. There we go. There. Ah. I'm almost completely dead already. Oh. So the evolvers have got it. Okay, I didn't realize that. Yes, that's good. We have a little bit more health now. Or, well, we have a piece of armor. So if I can be smarter about this... be a little better off than we were, and if I am able to get some money out of this. So I think we can buy a little bit of health back, too. Is that... just able to afford it. Okay. Okay, so we'll take the straight gun now. And we got the easiest one. Perfect. Gorgon is the easiest boss of the second floor, no matter what you really think. Thanks to how predictable her pattern is. Bit of credits and get ourselves some health back. There we go. Not looking too shit. Oh, that's the evolver. So what happened? This gun adapts. Well, some have disputed the claim that a gun can change shape or adapt its adapt to its new environment within the gungeon. This sudden appears to be irrefutable proof of the phenomenon. Since discovering the number of self-proclaimed gun evolution deniers increased by. 47. Hmm. 
Does that mean each boss we take down might... I was worried that this would kind of do the opposite of what the Devolver does, which basically... It basically makes your enemies go down a grade in what they are. Like, say you're getting hit by a shotgun guy, it'll reduce them down to a pistol user. Or a pistol user down to a bow user. I was worried it would kind of do the opposite of that, but... It's not a bad weapon, actually. It doesn't exactly have a high fire rate. There we go. And yeah, let's see, so we've got two greens. That's pretty good to have on the floor. And this is where Casey comes in. Casey can be a superb weapon as long as you are smart about using it. Oh. There we go. Didn't do too bad. Okay, let's head up to here. I will go into spoilers here for how you get them, so if any of you guys are just watching and don't want to be spoiled, sorry about the piss, but anyway, spoiler. In order to get the next characters, you have to find a time rift somewhere in the gungeon and either defeat your past... Oh, shit. I'm wasting a key on this bugger, too. Well, that's a very good find. Aw. Okay, well, let's head down here and get the key. There we go. Is there anything here really worth it? Uh, the sixth chamber might be. I don't know if cursed bullets really would or not. But you have to find time risk somewhere within the dungeon, then either kill the lich to unlock the gunslinger, or kill your pass for the Lich to get the Paradox. And then that's just a rat kind of room. We're not going for him. Oh, that was just poor. That was pathetic of me. Right, let's step this up. I know we're working some rust out, but we can be better than that. Go. Nope, there's a jam mess down here. Ooh, this does keep falling. It's a snail now? So I guess every boss you take down with it improves its level? So we got that... Was it the first floor? Yeah, it had to have been the first floor. Because this is its second kind of evolution now. right away. There we go, and let's refill the string. And 
not exactly the best item to get, but I suppose it's not the worst. And let's see what the shop has to offer. And we'll snag a key, and we'll save what we have. Ooh, you upgraded again. Is maybe every room I clear? Again, so I don't honestly know what to make of the evolver. It's neat so far. Ooh. That should have been a reflection. Okay, no more screwing around. That should have been another perfect kill. And we've got the Ring of Fire Resistance. Ooh, and it has a synergy. Ooh, we lose. Okay, that's a neat little feature to have. So, unfortunately, there's nothing in the Black Powder Mine that we were hoping for, but maybe we'll see something in the next floor, because we're at, oh, we might even be able to complete the gungeon in just a single episode. Uh, what do I want to use? I guess we'll use the Evolver, maybe it's up as far as we'll go now? Give you another chance, Casey, just in case. There we go. Yeah, Casey, uh. Maybe we'll try Carolyn. I don't know if maybe. And then there's the Elder Blank as well. I'm actually not sure. No, I don't think he's actually called the Elder Blank. Because the Elder Blank, I think, is actually an item that he might sell to us. I wouldn't mind. Uh, there's something off the shop. Ooh, I would love the Full Metal Jacket, though. Because that basically. What the uh, Full Metal Jacket does is as soon as you take damage, it uses a blank up instead of getting the hit. Charge time might have gone increased on that. I mean, it's still a superb weapon, but I don't know. It feels a little slower than I thought it used to. Used to be. Damn, better. Oh, what did the evolver just turn into? What are you now? Oh, Table Tech Rocket. I don't know what the Evolver is, but I am very eager to see now. This looks pretty cool. Oh, it, okay, the Evolver is one of my new favorite guns. It can work. It can one-shot the little guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I'm so glad we got this. It might not have a big immediate payoff, but that is so satisfying to see. Oh, gosh, the... 
over there. We'll take care of these little guys using Casey. I don't know. Charging feels a little weird now. I don't know if maybe that got changed an update or it's just been too long since I've played. Oh, there you are. And there you go. Alright, there's going to be you. Okay, let's open that up. All nice and done. Let's see. Okay, this is a bit of a delay fire. But it also is super, super good. Uh, we just gotta keep going with the Evolver. I love it. Oh, this is an awesome. Oh, I'm kind of tempted to also just leave it back and see, because maybe it'll get even stronger. That was dumb. I should have been able to avoid that one. Uh, what do I want to use? Ah, we'll go for air I guess. Item that made a charge faster, but the heroin feels a lot slower now. There we go. Okay, so. Oh, I know you're a damn. There you go. Yeah, I was, I was able to see that one. I gotta remember to be slower. I forget those guys are so common sometimes. Okay, but let's see. Really? And what's this? No, I have a way. Ooh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna sell the horn. Because that might. I think that did. We have three blanks, which are now going to basically become three pieces of armor for us because we're taking full metal jacket. Okay. And this. Probably kill pillars. I think that's what this boss is going to be. So those... I would like something that is a little bit more... Ah, you know what, we'll see how the Evolver does against them. Well, that was pretty dumb of me. Oh, come on, I'm getting way too many hits to take. Oh, man, I am blowing it. Well, there's a couple we're taken care of. I think 
that should still be a master. Yeah, it is another master chamber. Perfect. And I just want to take a quick. Yeah, I'm not getting fooled again so easily, you, you dumb mimics. Although the straight gun doesn't really do as much damage as I thought it would for. And... Oh, we got an extra item from that mimic. No, oh, but we. Don't really. Ah, shoot. You know what? That's not going to bug me too much. It's just a brown chest and a key. We've already got full health everywhere else. I don't see any time rifts. So that's not exactly what I was hoping for. I don't know if we can find a time rift down here or not. Because if not, I don't even think it's worth going to take down the lich, to be honest. Oh! Well, there is something down here. So there is something on the foundry. Do. You stop that. Eh, yeah, sorry, little buddy. Another blank to replace the one we just used up there. Oh, I forgot we have the rocket powered tabletop. Well, that opened the secret room for us. I have a long way to go to get back to where I was for my skill dealing with the game. Stun. Okay, that's nice to get. And let's head up this way. Well, let's check the Evolver again. Eh, nothing new in him, unfortunately. That's what we need. So that's a cell key, and that's exactly what we need for once a little bit up ahead. Ah, uh, Synergy Woman. We don't really need anything from her. Another Mimic. Do, do. I love that the, uh, I love we managed to get the timing perfect so that way it was off. Oh, well, another weapon there. And yeah, we'll use a key to get in here. So who are you? Hey, thank you for saving me. My name is Bowler. Bowler for short. Got a great offer for you. Just meet me in the breach and I'll tell you all about it. 
Oh, there we go. New guy unlocked for the breach. And now we just gotta try clearing through the rest of here. Use the evolver. Oh lord. Take care of that. And let's see, what do we want to go from here? Oh, there's a mini boss right down here. Might as well see how the evolver does against. Yeah, this is. You know, I'm kind of surprised that this is the only kind of. Oh, well, sort of the only mini boss. There's this one. Ah, shoot. Get there. Taking some dumb hits on this one. And this guy always gives me a little bit of troubles. There we go. Anything good? Ah, a couple of keys, so that's not bad. We have a chest we can actually get back here. So we might as well go do that. Nope, oh, the light gun. A lot to actually keep going through till we get to the dragon. So, nothing here. Let's go into the next room. Now we've got a jammed one of these guys. Uh oh, where's it going? There it is. Ah, we'll fill here. There we go. Let's move on to. Oh. Ah, I immediately walk in and take care of that one. Oh, I'm really starting to suck now. There we go. Take that down. And there's the next one. Got a blank back, so there's a little bit of protection. And let's try to wrap this up, because unfortunately, since we don't seem to have the time rip, I don't think it'll really be worth it to... Oh lord, oh boy. Aww. I know she been paying closer attention, but since we don't have the time rift, I don't think it will really be worth it to go through and try to take down the witch without it. Pet the puffer and refill some ammo. Here you guys a little bit. I do gotta admit, I really love the love the evolve. This is going to be a little intense. There are a lot of things flying everywhere. Now, and we got it. This is the last. Not barking. Oh, I don't know if we even really want that, but it's something. So let's go and see about getting these last few ones done. Can't really um, them boots aren't that good. We might as well just go for health. I should be able to handle the...
Oh, look at how quickly the Evolver's munching through them. Yeah, I've got a new favorite weapon in the dungeon now. Well, not complete favorite. I have to admit, my favorite is still going to be the gunbow. Although I've only ever really gone it twice. Oh, that's already out. Now let's see how well the straight gun can kind of help us out here. There we go. Yeah, it might actually be a good thing we didn't get to that time grip yet, because I'm admittedly not doing as well as I normally do. I might even try the ace in the hole character before trying to get the next unlocks. Just wait for that to go by. Okay. I guess maybe we'll try Case or the heroin for now. Really, really not doing as well as I should. I mean, not bad for. I guess it's been quite a few months since I. Um, let's see, something fast. You're a pretty fast shooter, I think. There we go. Another dragon kill. Not too bad. Nope. Oh, sunlight javelin unlocked. So that's another new item we might be able to see in the next run. But I think we'll leave things here. We'll save what's beyond this door for when we actually get the thing we need. But this has been another Enter the Gungeon run. Thank you guys very much for watching. I've been the Survival This. I'll see you in the next episode. If you'd like to see more content just like this, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll catch you again next time. Just remember to take care and stay alive.